Welcome back to Chew in the Kitchen. I'm Marissa and today we got a special treat for you. But before we get started, if you haven't subscribed, please hit the button below. You can also log in using any Gmail account. It's almost Halloween and what's better than a good old stew? So we're gonna make a beef stew today. Let's get started. To get started, I have already gotten my chuck roast ready. It's a two pound chuck roast that I have already seasoned with salt and pepper. I got it at my local grocery store. We're gonna go and brown it in our Le Creuset pan. It's a Dutch oven. You can purchase this on uh, www.chewinthekitchen.com or there's a link posted below. So I'm gonna go ahead and brown my meat. I've added a little olive oil to it and we're gonna go ahead and let it brown on each side for five minutes. Ooh, it's getting sizzled up. I think I need a little. All right, we're flipping that bad boy on over. I'm gonna get a flour and beef stock mixture going on here so I can go ahead and add that on over to my red wine and garlic base. I've got three tablespoons of uh, flour and two cups of beef broth. I'm gonna whisk it together. I'm now adding my uh, beef stock mixture into the mixture with the red wine. And I'm gonna go ahead and just stir it on up until it reduces down. You can see now it's turning to gravy. It's nice and thick. So this is the perfect time for me to reduce the heat just a little bit and go ahead and add in some bay leaves, two tablespoons of tomato paste, and salt and pepper. After this is all done, we're gonna go ahead and put our roast back into it and nestle it all in there. All right, I'm adding my roast back in and I'm gonna stir that gravy on top of that. Now I'm gonna stick it in my oven at 350 for an hour and a half. Mm. Ooh, I love Halloween. I just figured Chewbacca was so fitting, but you know what I love? Having Marissa in the kitchen with me because I'm never going solo when I'm with her. All right, so it's been an hour and a half. I just pulled this out. As you can see, it's looking good. I'm gonna go ahead and add in a few things. Um, I have one cup of water. And then I'm gonna add in some vegetables. I've got one whole onion. A pound of carrots. about two potatoes and some celery. I'm gonna go ahead and add it back into the oven for another hour or until your vegetables are nice and soft. All right, I just pulled out this meat and it looks great. I pulled out the piece of meat and put it on top, so now I'm gonna just peel it on back and you can see it's just falling apart. You just have to kind of, it's pretty tender and the meat just pulls right off of there. Something wicked this way comes. The stew is all done. I added some parsley to it. Follow me on Instagram at you in the kitchen. I'll see you next week.